Well, it is great to see you. Hope you're doing well. Number of things going on in our weather we need to talk about. So come on in. We'll check this out together. The warmth that we've experienced during the day, that is really influencing our overnight lows. Now we have cooled off some, but we're still holding on to some warmth as we go into our Tuesday morning. We're seeing a lot of 40s. We're seeing some 50s, a lot of upper 30s. And as we start out, even over into the higher elevations and western Wyoming, still feeling the effects of some of that warmth that we've been experiencing that has been beautiful weather for us. We get into our afternoon, we're going to go back into the 70s. Some of us will be in the 80s. We'll see some 60s, kind of a variety. And you'll notice in the south and southwest, we still have some warmth lingering, but we're not in those triple digits for us any longer in Phoenix. And we've cooled off to the lower 90s in Vegas. So we are starting to see some signs that fall is starting to make an appearance for us even across our desert southwest. Over into Tree and in the Rock, which is on the eastern side of the summit, the I-80 summit. It's a national monument and it is going to be 43 degrees in the morning. So a lower 40s across much of the summit. We're going to make it into the mid 60s. So we do have a chance to warm up some. We will have some sunshine. There's also some smoke on the horizon. That isn't really affecting our temperatures, but it's definitely affecting the air quality. So something to consider. Lower 40s for us in Thermopolis, into the lower 80s, mild for us into Thermop. Feeling pretty good. Over to the tower we go, lower 40s. And with that warmth during the day, we're going to make it into the 70s. We do have some cool air in place. That cool air is trying to make its way in, but it's staying across our northern tier, 36 for us in the western panhandle of Nebraska. So it's not making it all the way around, but it is circulating some, and we are seeing a mid-60 for us under completely abundant skies. We have some clear skies, some sunshine into the forecast. If you'd like to know what the weather will be where you live, all you got to do is go to wyomingnewsnow.tv, click in, and I will see you again soon.